People who have very delicate and fragile hearts are also very observant. They notice everything. Well, almost everything. They notice when they are being dismissed, ignored, rejected, or discriminated against. They notice if others are treated preferentially over them. They notice it if something is said or done even indirectly with the intention of wounding them. They notice and then they sit and start thinking about it. Most of the time they hold it in. They won't even show you that they noticed anything. They may even smile at you and laugh with you in the moment, superficially of course, but when they sit alone or lie in bed that night, they will think and think and think. And that's where the breaking of their fragile, delicate hearts begins to happen. It's in the thinking and analyzing, and often such people will, at the end of their day, take time to analyze everything that happened, including the things people said or did to them. And this can go into a very deep, dark hole. That's why such people cannot do without a healthy prayer life. You see, delicate one, your fragility is a gift. It is what produces brokenness before God in you, which is so fragrant before him. He loves it. It draws him to you. The way you break easily before him is because your heart is that way, fragile and delicate. But turned over to the other side can also be your greatest weakness, because people don't know how to handle fragile hearts most of the time. And so, you may end up with wounds that never really heal, and pain that never truly goes away. Such a person ends up being socially closed off and very guarded, because they are trying to protect the pieces of their hearts that are still intact. And even then, their being guarded is judged and interpreted as coldness and hatefulness or even pride. But they don't hate people, they are just afraid. Afraid because they have been wounded so much that they have decided to protect themselves by staying away from people as much as they can. But is that healthy? The answer from the Lord's heart is, Fragile one, stay very close to me. You are called into intimacy with my heart, for there you will know a love perfect and wholesome, a love that will never break you. Stay very close to me, leaning heavily on me, and casting all your weight on me. I will protect your heart and give you wisdom on how to relate with other people in such a way that you are harmless and wise at the same time, even in situations where you can easily be hurt. Stay close to me, and I will cover you.